Nathan, we really need to make a decision. I need to know what you think. I think I could have drove myself to work. Yeah, but then we wouldn't have had the chance to talk about indoor versus outdoor venues. I mean, I've never really seen myself as a beachy bride, but I have to tell you, the idea of a destination wedding does have its appeal. Or we could get married on a mountain. What do you think, sand, snow? I told you, all I care about is hearing you say, I do. Well, that's incredibly sweet and romantic. The ceremony has to be something that represents both of us. I need your input. Okay, fine. I promise I will choose my favorite season and come up with some kind of an opinion about indoors versus outdoors, if we can talk about this later. We can. Thank you. I just need you to know that I'm going to hold you to that. We are going to have an in-depth discussion about this, leaving no option unconsidered. Maxie. Yes? Sooner or later, every time we get to talking about this, it turns into an interrogation about Claudette. So if that's what this is going to be... Why would you even think that? I clearly have a lot more important things to focus on besides your ex-wife. I meant what I said. I'm not going to ask you any more questions about Claudette. I'm glad to hear it. Because from now on, I just want to focus on my future with you and forget about my past. I will see you at home, ready to discuss the pros and cons of a destination wedding. I can't wait. Any response from the possible eyewitnesses? Uh, yeah, Commissioner, I need your assistance. With what, exactly? Carlos Rivera no longer feels safe in your jail. Really? Well, it seems safer than a parking garage. And <laughs> while I regret to hear that he's unhappy with his accommodations, I don't see anything I can do about it. I had a feeling you might say that, which is why I decided to take action. I've arranged for Mr. Rivera to be transferred, and I need someone to accompany him to the new facility. Rivera is the defendant in a very high-profile murder case, and he has connections to organized crime. It's going to take at least 24 hours to arrange adequate security. We don't have that kind of time. Surely there must be some officer on desk duty whom you trust. I'll do it. I'll go. Really? Yeah, it's fine. I'm happy I mean, to do it. this is somewhat out of the detective's purview. Rivera is an important witness, knows a lot of secrets. It is crucial that his trip is uneventful. May I come in? Of course. Everything okay? Why didn't you tell me? Tell you what? That you and Rocco moved back in with Dante. I called Windermere. They said you had vacated the premises. Give me a hug. I'm so happy for you. you. The couple that gave me faith in couple them is finally back together. Thank you. It feels incredible. You helped, you know. Dante and I were inspired by you and Nathan at your engagement party. It was obvious how in love you two are. This is amazing. <laughs> We're in perfect sync. I mean, you and I are both with the men that we love. How's the wedding planning going? Oh. We picked a venue, guest list, color scheme. I'm trying, but being the bride is a lot different than being just the wedding planner. I can see why brides go crazy. <laughs> you just a low, bite your tongue. Nathan and I are gonna have a huge shindig, a blowout to end all blowouts. <laughs> Speaking of which, um, I have a question for you. 